Hi, dear friend. This is Alexander from Shasky Tech Corporation Limited. Uh, in this short video, I want to show you how to upgrade or change the firmware that is pre-installed in this Starlink WS6980 model. Yes, this is the Finder device. Uh, for example, when users want to change the, the, the device to be used from the United States to somewhere in Europe or Middle East, the corresponding firmware may need to be changed or need to be upgraded. Yeah, namely from the American region version to the Europe Middle East version. Uh, yeah, this short video, I, I will show you how to operate it. First of all, of course, we need to get the upgraded fitting firmware from selling manufacturer our long-term partnership a partner yeah for over five years and uh, we can always get its newest version of firmware for various, various regions typically there are european regions uh american atlantic asia pacific yeah uh okay in this uh, selling WS six nine eight zero zero. This is the final device. Uh, currently, as we can see, the DVB S two under the under the page, there exist uh, the satellite list many for the American region, right? Galaxy, MC, Echo Star, Direct TV, and a lot of uh, satellite lists from Latin America. I guess so. Yeah. Star One, Simon Bolivar, Sky Mexico, right? Yeah. And uh, if if me as a user, I want to take the device to be used in somewhere in Europe, for example, UK, France. Yeah. Literally, we need to get the upgraded version of the firmware for the Europe region. I need to change it. Okay. Uh, in fact, this procedure will take just uh, several limited minutes. Very convenient. Of course, now I have already downloaded the the, the firmware version for for European region into this USB disk. I have already downloaded it, and I will insert it into the USB disk on my WS six nine eight zero meter. Yes, I have inserted into the USB port. And now we access the system setting icon. Uh, we will access the upgrade, select, okay, click yes. And then we access this USB card upgrade. We press this button. And then we will access 6980 model, the newest version. Okay, this one, uh, perhaps this is not the newest, so I will access somewhere else. With 3.9, this one may be newer. As we can see, Europe, UK, and Europe. This bin file is the volume for the European region. Or Middle Eastern region. Okay, let me click it. Read data. Erase flash. Update flash. Yeah, it's automatically doing the job by itself. We just wait for about uh, one to two minutes. I guess so. Let's wait. Uh, in fact, this uh, selling WS six nine eight zero model is. Is the highest end sub final meter device among selling series, uh, according to various comments given by our customers from all over the world. This device does perform very well. Yeah, either in Middle East, Europe, America, Australia, and some Asian countries. Yeah, it supports DVB-S S2 CTT2. Of course, if it is applied in North America. The DVB T T two will not be use, uh, useful, since the American government or other North American governments don't support DVB T T two. Instead, they support ATSC. 
I guess so. Now it is nearly completing this process. Update flash, yeah. And then you will automatically restart. We just wait. Because the device is doing the job by itself. Okay, you restart it. Note, at this moment, it is not yet completed. One last step, sometimes be ignored by some users. This last step is system setting, access it. Then we need to click into the factory reset to select it. We need to set the factory reset, otherwise it is not completed. Yeah, this is the last step. And then now we can change the well, we can check the DVBS2 icon and find whether the, the sunlight listed here has been changed. Hot bird, red, butter, uh, Bulgaria set, Rescom, UT set, Azure, Arab set, uh, including Pakistan set, Arab set, and Hellas. Yeah, I guess from Greece, right? Nigerias, Nikon set, other Intel, maybe Turkey or Azerbaijan, Africa, yeah, some set, Balance, Turk Monaco, Kazakhstan, yeah, uh, it covers the main region in Europe and Middle East and some of maybe South Asia, yeah, we can check it. This is the upgraded version for the Europe Middle East region and here as we can see it support DVBS2, T2C and uh, support spectral analysis and uh, system setting here note after we do our job at first stage it is important for us to select the factory reset this simple last step is very important for us to complete the whole upgrading job. Okay, okay. Uh, I, I guess this short video can be uh, clear to show you how to upgrade it. And thank you for your time. If you have any demand, contact us, Alexander from Shaska Tech Corporation Limited. Full service of sunlight finders and DVB-T uh, meters of sunlight series can be sourced from our company yeah we are a, a wholesaler on this field for for quite many years and we have many customers who appreciate our service uh, yeah not boasting but telling the truth thank you have a good day bye bye